What's up? So I have a story for you today. This morning when I first woke up, I had a comment on one of my last videos where I was talking about chemtrails, getting ready to release a song that's called Until the End of the World. And I'm hopefully shooting a video for it. And I've already shot some, some B-roll of the chemtrails um, about two or three weeks ago, right before all the big rains here in California. I was looking for a perfect day to go out and sing some of the verses. So I decided to go out there today and do a little bit of uh, filming, right? I didn't quite realize what I was actually going to capture. So if you have any doubts about what they're doing in the sky, check this out. This entire segment is 20 minutes long. So I was out there for 20 minutes before they completely blocked out the sun. And uh, what I did was, is I sped it up so that you can see the progress of 20 minutes over about a minute and a half. Check this out. Welcome to Los Angeles, California. Look at these beautiful blue skies. Now, this is a regular airliner that is a passenger airliner that goes to the Burbank Airport. What's interesting about this is there's no contrail. There's nothing coming out of the engines whatsoever. Huh. I see these over my house probably maybe every hour or so. So that is the normal flight path of air traffic coming over my house. Now, if you draw your attention to the upper left of the screen, huh, and notice it's not dissipating. Now take your attention to the far right of the screen. This is nuts. Look at all that crap in the sky. And I've been watching that since this morning when there was completely blue skies up to the left. Man, this is just nasty stuff. That was crazy, right? YouTube actually put a, a warning or a, I don't know what you call it, some sort of uh, a correction uh, of my last video that had chemtrails in the title. And it, it says contrail. Contrail. Hmm. So anyway, this morning I emailed Keith back and I said, uh, Keith, thanks for your comment. Uh, and, uh, it's great to hear that, you know, you're aware and you know what is going on. By the way, you should go check out his can his channel. His name is Keith Kessinger. I think it's how you pronounce it. K-E-S-S-I-N-G-E-R. So cool. He's a, uh, he's a, an, an exceptional musician and he's a he's a pretty good singer too i guess you would have to be a good singer if you got the word singer in your last name so anyhow go to his youtube channel it's uh, keith dash k-e-s-s-i-n-g-e-r he he was in a band called uh stick kitty i think and uh probably a little bit more famously imagine world peace Imagine World Peace. What a name for a band, right? We played together on the Sunset Strip uh, back in the 80s. I mean, that, as, as far as I'm concerned, is the, the, the name to end all names. Uh, Keith, I don't know if you had anything to do with naming uh, Imagine World Peace, but what, a, what, a, what an excellent name. Excellent band, too. I thought I would give you a little taste of uh, the, the new song. It's not going to be released for probably about a month, maybe a month and a half or so. So I just started filming parts of the video. So it may be a while before I'm able to shoot it, edit it, and color correct it and all that stuff. So I thought I would put a trailer together, kind of utilizing this, um, this footage that I shot today. Because it was inadvertently a real eye-opener, you know?
So I'm going to sign off now with this and be looking for until the end of the world. I'll, I'll speak to you before then, but I uh, hope everybody's doing good. All right. Peace. Honestly clarify Why toxic chemtrails are killing our blue skies And there's nobody coming to save us